Let's take a look at stagetimer.io and how you can use it to keep your events on time. Launch right into your first stagetimer.io room by clicking on the create a timer button right on the top of the homepage. Within seconds, I have a room ready to start using and a 10 minute timer ready to roll. I'll add a few more timers here. In fact, I can add up to three in this free version. To add more timers, I've just signed into my pro account here and I can add as many as I want. I'll leave the first timer at 10 minutes, but I'm gonna update the second one to be a 20 minute timer instead. And the third I'll change to be a 60 minute timer. And I've just made all those changes by clicking on the duration and setting it manually. I don't need this fourth one for now, so I'll just remove it. So I have a few timers ready and now I can use this room for something useful. I can use the links button to take a look at all my options. For now, I just wanna grab the viewer link and open that up on a different tab. Here I can see the overall progress of my timers, nice and big, and I can put that on an external monitor. I've opened up that viewer link on my other computer here so I can keep a close eye on the timer as it ticks down. I'll just set it behind me for now. From there, I can start the timer on stagetimer.io and I can automatically see it count down within the stage timer UI and on the computer behind me. When I'm ready to invite more people, I can share other types of links, like this controller link, which gives them full access to stop starting timers and making all the changes. With that link, other people can send messages to the host, for example, hurry, up, I can share that here and I can see it on my main screen and on the screen behind me as well. They can even flash the timer to make it extra clear that people should look down and see how much time they have left or they can start a new timer just to switch topics throughout the show. Alternatively, I can share an agenda link which gives a really nice visual breakdown of the upcoming timers so a client or audience member can follow along with the show. And by signing up for an account on stagetimer.io, I can see all of my previously created rooms and the ones I'm working on so I can jump in later and quickly access them. So that's a quick look at getting you up and running with stagetimer.io.